It seems we've found an obvious culprit in Miss Javita Munez. The missing padlock from the cooler, the rat poison. It almost seems too convenient. I think it's Why are you telling me this? It's not like we were close or anything. Well, we have a motive too. Pictures of you and Susan Myers, and how should we put it delicately, flagrante delicto. It seems your involvements with the staff are a little too tangled. What? I knew nothing about this. You mean she did all this because I had a fling with Susan? Oh my God, what have I done? Tom hasn't done anything. His indiscretions may have led to this, but he would never have put them up to it. There's no reason for it. <sighs> Look, this whole thing is a freaking mess and I'm trying to put a cap on it. So both of you listen good. Javita was stealing from the house. She poisoned Agnes because she was onto her. We'll ignore all the uh, indiscretions in the report for the sake of your family. Whatever it takes, Detective. We want to put this all behind us. I'll straighten Tom out, but I don't think I'll be able to save my campaign at this point. The press will have a field day. Well, there's nothing I can do about that, Mr. Wagner. But they won't get a story from me. I'm just trying to make a living. We'd finally managed to close the case, sir. So I thought. Seems like she had been behind every death so far in the house, except the butler. It kept bothering me. Could that really be an accident? Every path we took on the case left me uneasy. Then, right on time, a month later, it happened again. It looked like another suicide. It might have been me who pushed him over the edge. And for that, I am ashamed. MacGuffin. A mind can take only so much. We report at 10 p.m. At Thomas Point Light, the air temperature was 60 degrees. The winds were from the east at 13 knots. The water temperature was 58 degrees. The current time is 10 40 p.m. You left the radio on. You've you've awoken me. You've disturbed my sleep. And I appreciate it. Where's that coming from? Shut that shit up. Understand? Why did she do it? She was tired of watching you pour alcohol over yourself, man. Please, I need to be alone now. I picked up the camera. I saw a map on the table. Oh, Lucius! How could she do it? Why would she do such a thing? You know what? I just remembered I forgot to grab uh, this. Okay. You know, Tom, I have a feeling your gra your death is going to be one of the best. You're such a good uncle. Now then, let's go. Uh, let's get some fun. Back out of that room. <laughs> Let's see, what's the best way to get where I want to be? Hey, Mommy. I still haven't taken the trash out. Leave your father alone. He's very upset. I mean, he has a lot to deal with right now. Is, is Daddy beating you again, Mommy? You know, time
time passes a lot faster with music. Hi, Lucius. Oh, hi, Lucius. Hey, guys. If you have some spare time, you can search for my band's cassette. Here. I would, but I have to wait until your father gets here. I understand. Here it is. Oh, you found it. I did find awesome. it. Awesome. Thanks a lot, Lucius. I'm sure you'll like it, too. Um, I don't want to listen to it, do I? Do I not get any behavior status for that? Hello, darling. But I'm such a good little boy. Hi, Lucius. Hey. Don't mind me. I don't know. That's just what I heard. It's been a month, and Tom's still locked in his room, drinking his sorrows away. Drinking his sorrows away. He's a sad man. All right, let's see. Gotta be a reason why I mentioned the map that leads me here. Okay. Is this locked still? It is. Okay. Oh, maybe to get this? Oh, I know. This is this one's a little bit too easy, I think. If it's as easy as what I think it is. Yep, it is. And I found the chamber of Tom's whiskey bottle. Okay. Let's go bring Tom a little sippy sip. Feeling mighty thirsty, Tom. You're such a good uncle. Hey, Tom. I know that bottle feels really good on your chest. But let me pour this one down your throat. Oh, Lucius. Why? I don't understand. Why did she do it? I don't know, Uncle. Sometimes you just can't explain women. Can I? You. you did this! You little shit! You did it all! You... What's that? Get that cough out of your mouth. I can't quite hear you, Uncle Tom. Tom? Dad. It's me, Charles. Please open the door. We're tired of hearing your stupid weather report. Oh shit, no. Not this, no. Not this, no. Not this, no. Mr. Wagner, I'm at a loss for words. You came to your own conclusions, Detective. Our family is suffering a great shame now. I have little hope after this. I want you and your men out of this house by nightfall. There's nothing more for you here. Except we'll take murder. care of our own problems from now on. Again, I'm really sorry for your loss. I'll say a prayer for you and your family, Mr. Wagner. Forgive me, Father, for I have sinned. It has been, oh, I don't know, a long time since my last confession. There's a family. Their home is befallen by calamities. I can't explain. I've been trying to help, but I may have involved myself too far. I, I've been having nightmares, terrible scenes playing through my head, and this family, they are the players. It sounds to me like this family needs help, my son. 
It sounds to me like the church should intervene. You better stay the fuck out of my house, I'll murder you. Daddy, if the church wants to enter our home, what are we going to do? Hello, Lucius. You are doing well. Thank you. But I do tire of these menial offerings. Maids, butlers, accountants, drunks. That's all we Don't got here in the family. Don't you think it's time to up the stakes? Maybe make this a little more personal. There are some sneaky snakes in your fold, Lucius. You need to weed them out of the grass. Let me show you something else you can do to help on your journey. You have the ability to make people forget things. This can be very useful. Oh. What skill and promise you display? The higher the stakes, useful. my son, the more power can be derived from the sacrifice. Look closer to your foe, Lucius. Do me proud. I will do you proud, father. I wonder who's next. Will it be mommy? Daddy. Apparently uncle wasn't family enough. He was drunk though. Grass is always red on this side. Huh. Hello there. It's springtime. What a better way to welcome in spring than with murder. Whose turn is it today? We don't know yet. Let's find out. No one's in mommy's room. It's kind of dark in the house. This guy is not a human. Okay. I didn't know that thing was going to have charges. I don't, I don't like that. I 
that it's gonna be a useless air compressor someday. I'm just going to run in front of this mower and put this rock down. <laughs> that didn't work. Okay. Ooh. Move away, Lucius! wasn't even turned on. Or plugged in, I mean. Hey, look at this cord placement. It goes like over here and up around. It's pretty funny. Right, wonder if that cord's been sitting like that all this time. Okay, I really want to do something with this air compressor now that's plugged in. Really badly. Key sort of, I got locked whenever I got that. The the mechanic is um his uh, turn, and I had to grab the keys to get out. And that's why I have keys that you guys never saw me use. What are those earrings are for? I can always use a rock to break something. Yeah, I don't think there's a use for this yet. Oh, what's this? Ooh, a nail gun! Jesus Christ! Oh, apparently those items have been used correctly. I think I'm jumping ahead here. Oh, I feel like he's gonna... He's gonna need... to use the air compressor... for something. And he's going to have a nail come out into his face. Okay, so all that's been set up now. I guess. Right, now I just gotta break. I gotta break something with this rock. Something that would require an air compressor to fix. The hey, I don't know if the garbage is nearby here. I could take it out. Is it in here? Face. 
Son of a... Where did this rock come from? I bet I can fix this. Might be my chance. To do what? I went weeks without a proper night's sleep. I just couldn't wrap my head around everything as if something was evading me. I resorted to the church for help. My hope was that they could visit the house and maybe help some of the people there, offer counsel, whatever it is priests do. <laughs> I was wrong. Predictably, there was another accident, this time in the garden. One of the most bizarre things I had ever seen. I had no solid explanations, and the press were hounding the department for information. Those vultures were constantly circling the mansion. Everything in my world was falling apart. I was interviewing Charles Wagner on a daily basis now. He tried to tell me this was in a totally different realm. His father, Fabius, who I thought was a little batty, had gone missing by this stage. Mm -hmm. Everyone presumed he just took off to escape the stress. So that was my grandfather that knew what was going on. I have a hard time keeping track of who's here. What's really going on, Dad? Have we been cursed? Do we have enemies? Are we being extorted? Or is this some sort of vendetta? Don't talk such rubbish, Charles. You're grabbing at straws. I know enough about your past mob ties. I know how we got our money. You don't know shit. And don't ask. Just be thankful for what I've given you. Have you no feelings, Dad? Why didn't you come to Tom's funeral? He was a wastrel, and he died a wastrel's death. He was no son of mine. That's cold by any stretch. You're a heartless, bitter old man. Who's given you everything you could have ever possibly wanted, and now it's time for payback. There are events afoot which are far beyond anything you would understand. I'm gonna lose this election, my world is falling apart, Lucius won't speak, Nancy is losing our mind, and you're crazy too! We're all just pawns in the larger scheme of things. 
These people, they're just fodder for death's eventual scythe. You only need to play your role, Charles, and be a good boy. Yeah, be a good boy. There are rewards for those who endure to the end. Good afternoon, miss. I'm Father Lagel of the Winter Hill Diocese, and this is Father DeCosimo. We've heard of the unfortunate tribulations that have befallen this house, and we've come to offer a blessing for better days for this place. Would the master or mistress Who be home? Who is that? What? Get the hell out of my house, bloody parasites! Take your skirts back to the poor mix in town. They'll swallow your Jesus crap. But get off my lawn, or I'll give you a reason to pray for your Easter bunnies. Dude, you tell them, bro. Have a truck here on my property. Make sure they're let out those gates. Oh my God. 